Welcome back to Atlanta and Company. I'm Holly Furfer. Here's a sweet way to make your mom feel very special on Mother's Day. Bake her a pie. Pie genius chef Sonia Jones from the Sweet Auburn Bakery is here today to show us how to bake a fun and easy pie that says, I love you. Good morning, Sonia. Good morning, Holly. Thanks for having me here. Oh, we're so excited you're here. Now, before we get started, uh, we just want to show everybody how actress Carrie Russell gets her inspiration for her pies in the new movie Waitress. So let's take a quick look. Oh, no. <gasps> Looks like a paint line is forming. One line or two lines? Two lines. The control line and the other line. The bad line. The yes line. Can you see that now? <gasps> two lines. Two definite lines. There's no mistake in them. What's going on in there? They have customers. I'm fine, Cal. We'll be right out. Hurry up. Are you okay? Shh. I'm inventing a new pie in my head. Tomorrow's blue plate special. I'm calling it, I don't want Earl's baby pie. I don't think we can write that on the menu board, huh? Then I'll just call it bad baby pie. What's in it, honey? It's a quiche of egg and brie cheese with a smoked ham center. Sounds good, baby. I ain't. Ooh, that does sound good. That was Carrie Russell in her new movie, Waitress, that comes out tomorrow right here in Atlanta. And I'm Sonia, what do you think of her quiche? That sounded delicious. That's getting me hungry. <laughs> yeah. Okay, and speaking of being hungry, um, I just have to ask you, because you are the pie guru, what's the most creative pie you've ever made? What comes to my mind is a strawberry rhubarb pie that I made, but what was really different about it is that I actually used the rhubarb in strips and used it to make the lettuce crust for the pie instead of being inside of it. Oh, interesting. <laughs> wow, you are good. Okay, and what are you going to show us today? Well, today we have this very berry custard for mom. Ooh, that looks good. And delicious. I love to, use, love to use fresh fruit, seasonal things. Mm -hmm. And, of course, we want to make it simple so everyone knows that they can make it. So I'm going with a basic custard filling. Okay. And just pairing with this fresh berries. But we're going to make a pie dough. Okay. And pie dough simple, just flour, salt, water, and your butter. Okay. And here, and what's great about it, you can make it ahead of time. Oh, yes. This dough, I made it ahead of time, wrapped it and refrigerated it, so I have very little amount to roll out. Okay. Just dust it with the flour and um, roll it out. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to put it in the pie pan. Okay. And so I come over oh, here. Here we go. Look. Okay. The magic of television. <laughs> here it is in the pie pan. But, but that's what's great. As I say, you can make this ahead of time. <laughs> that's great. we push for time. It, today's, it could be made today, refrigerated. Oh, that's you a great point. You can make point. it Saturday or, so, you know, depending have on the time frame. So that's Mother's what's Day. great about this, okay? But you do want to cover it so that it doesn't get hard. Okay. Okay? So then we're just going to make a filling. And as I said, I'm using a classic custard filling. Okay, what you need? Simple ingredients. I'll be your assistant. Okay, great. You can the bowl and the utensil. Okay, now what is with. in that okay. bowl? We have butter underneath there, melted butter, but we have flour, sugar, and a little nutmeg for seasoning. Ooh, nice. But, you know, to, okay, and then the I want the little uh, fresh grated nutmeg right there. This too. is nutmeg? Yeah. No, no, that's the vanilla. Oh, that's I have vanilla. nutmeg in here. Let me have that too. Oh, okay. okay. So what we're going to do is... Um, <laughs> <laughs> Got it. We're Vanilla. Good. Okay. You can tell I so spent a lot of time baking in the okay. kitchen. Great. Okay. Then we just want to have the eggs. I have the eggs right there. You can have okay. the eggs. Great. And that's the key thing is once everything's ready, we're just going to add it to the bowl. Oh, terrific. Mm -hmm. Okay. You mix those eggs up right. first. Yeah. Mix them up a little. And then just add it right in there. Exactly. And then... Very nice. And we're just combining this. You don't, it's not a whole lot of whipping. And what's great, you don't even have to have a mixer. Very By nice. hand, it's great. Okay. And then, this is combining, you can pour a little, half of it maybe, half? of the half and half. This is okay. half and half. Now, do you have a secret to making pies? Well, I think a light hand. A light I hand? A light hand. I think a light hand. It's to say, I'm, I'm just combining, I'm mixing this. I'm not whipping it, you know, not over mixing it. It's made with love. Do exactly. I put the rest in? Yes, you can pour the okay. rest in now, see? Pick it up. Okay. <laughs> I like being the assistant better than the... Cheese. Okay, and then we're just going to um, we have a little bit of a shallow bowl. I guess we could have found that's a great. bigger mm -hmm. bowl. That's good. And that's vanilla. Pure vanilla. Pure vanilla, not Pure vanilla. imitation. No, There's no, a no. Difference. Pure vanilla. Okay. <laughs> okay. Now we have this ready, and again, as I said, I'm going to line the pan with fresh berries. Oh. So we're going to the cut up strawberries. Cup. Yes, we have a cup okay. of the strawberries, fresh strawberries, and we have fresh blueberries. Ooh. They're good antioxidants. Oh, they're good. Great. Now, berries are in season right now. Mm -hmm. Strawberries, berries, exactly. raspberries. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then 
we're just going to pour the filling over the fruit. Really? That's know. simple. It's, it's great. I could even do this. Of course you could. Wow. I think you can even remember the recipe. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> now, how long does it usually take pies to bake? I would say average about 45 minutes. Typically, you know, I would say less than an hour. You know. So then the whole thing can be done within an hour or less. Oh, definitely, oh, definitely, terrific. definitely. Mm -hmm. So then you just bake it like that? Mm -hmm. And again, you could even make the whole pie at a time. You could bake it and just chill it um, in the refrigerator. Okay. And then, so once you've done baking it and it's cooled, when do you add all the beautiful stuff on once the top? Once it's cooled. We, we need to cool at least a couple of hours. Okay. And then, and here I garnished it with some uh, sweetened whipped cream. Oh. Simple. Heavy cream, a little powdered sugar. Just whip it till it forms the peaks. And uh, can you see, I, I'm going to tilt this a bit. Can you see how beautiful the design is? It looks almost like it's a swirl, but I guess that's the way the strawberries and the blueberries exactly. rose to the top. Exactly. Absolutely gorgeous. And it smells delicious. It's colorful. And I think mom would think that's a very special treat. She's going to taste it, very smell nice. the aroma, and she's going to love it. It's beautiful. Wonderful. No other tips you can give us? I know, <laughs> soft hand, gentle with love. Anything else? Since well, I don't bake. Just make sure that you get deal with what's in season. That yeah. way you have great flavor. That's what you're looking for when you eat a pie. And as far as a, a great crust, of course, a light hand, roll out mm -hmm. the dough. But I think work with what's in season. I think that's a key thing to keep in mind. Very good mm -hmm. advice. Sonia, thank you so much. Great, I have something for you. Oh, you do? It's great, of course. Let me. <gasps> Very exciting. Right oh, here. this? Yes. Oh, let's grab that. <laughs> This is a package from the movie Waitress. And oh. actually, this is going to help you with your pie baking career. Very you nice. Everything that you need and more. Very nice. Right. And actually, um, thank you so much for this. And this is just wonderful. Great, great. We Enjoy. appreciate it. Nice to thank see you. Thank you having me here. I'm going to be a pro now. <laughs> and uh, make sure that you go check out the movie Waitress when it comes out in theaters tomorrow. It looks terrific. And you can find Chef Sonia's recipes on our website under the What's Cooking section.